Hey everyone, and welcome back to Spelunky. Today, I am bringing myself here with one goal that may become overshadowed by other goals, but the idea is that I am going to get a no gold run. It's going to happen, I'm going to succeed, it isn't going to be a problem. So, it, it's a very simple concept as well. I get no gold, and then I win. I only have to beat all mech, I don't have to go to hell or anything, that would be pretty insane. And uh, immediately, we've got this jerk right here, that I just straight up have to bomb. Alright. Oh, god, okay. So basically every time I pick up gold, I'm gonna kill myself. If I make it to level 2, and happen to see that there is a shop that is prime for either giving me a teleporter or giving me a good high score run, uh, that's going to take priority, and that's what I mean when I say that uh, it might not be the priority goal. But that's those two take priority, just because I like using the teleporter and need to get practice with it, and because my whole goal right now in general is to get like a million and a half dollars, approximately. But um, otherwise, this is a goal that I'm in direct control over, and that's something that's really nice, and prob probably even better to view since it's just I can actually go somewhere with direction instead of just dying for a little bit until I get something that I want to play in a certain way or just playing random runs and seeing how things go for me um okay so dang it oh come on alright fine that's how you want to be spelunky I was trying to save what I could I wanted to... I kind of... Okay, with three ropes, I will rescue her now. Okay, no mess-ups on this gold. That would be really kind of super embarrassing. But we're good. Uh, I will totally murder shopkeepers, don't get me wrong. Because uh, I don't like the idea of doing a run with no items. But that's a hired help shop, so I'm just totally not into that idea at all. That was useful. And if I happen to find the uh, chest, I'll totally take the U-Jedi. It can help me avoid gold by knowing what I'm blowing up. That's exactly where I expected it to be, I'm going to be honest with you. That should not have hit me. Let's just be real with ourselves. I mean, I obviously messed up the whip, but it totally, I don't, I didn't think I did. So that's the jungle, no gold, no big deal. And then that happens. Always with this thing happening. Okay. Uh, that way doesn't actually look very promising. Okay. Just trying to, oh, okay, wait, he's not gonna, oh, he does throw it at me. I wasn't sure. Okay, jump over that, use... Th ah, excellent, bombs. It's all about jumping in the right places at the right times. Oop. Okay, we're good. Dark levels are really the worst for no gold in so many ways, but the jungle is also a bad place simply because of things like trees, which, like, they only grow to screw you over in no gold runs. That's the only reason they're in the game, I'm sure. I'm gonna hit you, hit you. I see that gold. See, I gotta check there for gold just in case. Okay. Do it again. Gotta be sure. Okay, well, that's unpleasant. How does this look? Okay, I can pull that off. Can you both die? That'd be really nice. Oh, you barely didn't make it. Uh, I will happily take this boomerang. Okay, uh, looks like we're good. If I see the black market, I will totally go. Um, we'll totally go. It's a pretty easy level. Like, there's pretty much... It, it's super easy to avoid gold there. I'm dumb. 
but actually that's totally fine. Okay. Uh... Ah, so much careful platforming here. That's exactly how that needed to go down, honestly. Flipping gold is quite a useful tool. Alright, just... good. That's what I needed from you, to turn around and ignore me. I mean, snails do totally ignore you, by the way. It's not like they are out to get you, they just happen to be neutral there, ready to kill you if they have to. Oop. Okay, that's... okay. I'm just gonna stay away. I have you, Jedi, so I know there's no anything in there that will give me money. And I'm still in the game. If I get this too soon, I don't even know what I'll do. <sighs> every every level entrance, I'm terrified that it's just gonna... Okay. Alright. I'm just terrified that there's gonna be... Oh my god. Something. I don't even know what I'm saying anymore. Oh, dark level. I'm terrified of a dark level. Okay, that's fine. Just don't let me get hit by the gold. We're good. Okay, I want to kill both of y'all. Yeah, y'all. Alright, uh, I'm going to put this down. You can see that there's no gold there leave for the ice caves with just a boomerang to my name <sighs> certainly is an interesting way to play with no items okay I'm thinking that this is totally the right way and that was all planned sometimes you get lucky ice caves levels fortunately ice caves can't have dark levels but there is a track for it on the soundtrack interestingly enough Oh, you don't say. Um, hmm. Freeze ray, please. How much freaking health do you have? Okay. That's perfectly placed. Okay, that was scary. Uh, I'm gonna put a bomb here and hopefully blow that dude up. Oh, I just missed. Okay, so, uh, we're flirting with disaster a little bit. Because now I have to place a bomb perfectly right there. No gems fly at me. But I think that was placed well enough that we get the jetpack. Yes. Okay, now we have a jetpack. It allows us to be a little more careful and have way better movement here on the ice caves. We don't have spike shoes or anything. I don't want to. I don't want to. <laughs> I'm just taking this chance and going with it. Uh, so far, this has been really well handled. I probably could have gotten away using one or two less bombs there, maybe. Okay, another perfect ice caves level. Ice caves are generally pretty easy to deal with without picking up gold. And apparently quickly. Okay, no snow. That's so much nicer than you can even realize right now. The snow, it hides gold pretty well. Okay, okay, uh, we're gonna be okay. Into the temple. We have to make it through three levels of the temple, and then Olmec as well. I'm certainly not confident. Okay, so here's what we're going to do. We're going to hurry up. Alright. No reason to take silly chances like that one. Uh, letting that hit me or something. Okay. This is going so exceedingly well that I'm just waiting for the failure. Okay, ropes. Sure. I'm gonna use a bomb for those. Uh, I'm dumb. Why did I not think that would happen? That's exactly what was gonna happen. 
I could have known that, and I could have not wasted a bomb. So very easily. I was waiting for that to be the moment where... God, all the freaking lava. Okay, no stuff hiding there, no gold. I don't like the croc man. I don't like him at all. Oh, leave me alone, croc man. God. Okay. 4-2 completed. That's... Better than I've ever done. Thinking that this way is the right way. Don't see me, Croc Man. You're not invited to the seeing me party. Uh, this is a super unpleasant situation. Okay. So much lava today. Alright, I knew I was fine there. Alright. Two Olmec. <sighs> now the scary part is not picking up gold on Olmec. It's all going to be a matter of where I make the hole. It's pretty much unavoidable that there's going to be gold there, so I have to be really, really careful. Like, really, really, really careful. You can crush that, and that's totally fine. Tw Twelve bombs. Oh my god. Olmec, oh, you're a hero. Okay, that's, that's truly all we need. Don't even bother me. Okay, um, stand super far away, and just hope for no gold. Uh, that was not an optimal hole, which is okay. Darn, that won't be either. Okay, good. Olmec doesn't see me like this. Again, this is the scary part. Not picking up any gold in this process. How avoidable does gold look down there? Not super easily avoidable. How are we looking? We're okay, there was no gold under that. Yeah, sure. Alright, how about you get down there? Olmec, why are you why are you mad at me? Don't thank you for not falling in that hole. I would have been very upset with you. <sighs> so we have a very unique predicament. This probably should have repositioned that. <sighs> We're just widening the hole. In hopes of being able to deal with this situation more easily. That's not the way to do it. Okay, there is no gold right here. All right, so this is a little bit risky. Oh, thank you, base all my. But actually, this is terrible. This is really terrible. Okay, come down over here. Well, that's not where I wanted it to be. We really do have... Oh, he handled the gold. That's so good. Can you go more that way? Thanks. Ah. 
Well, let's do the truly safest thing we can do right now. Okay, so what I needed. Come this way, Olmec. Now it's time for a little bit of investigative journaliz journalism. Okay. We can do it. It'll be scary. Jump again. Now. Jump. Are you joking? Oh my god. No, please. Please. What is my solution here? <sighs> Alright, I know what I have to do. God, is this awful. Enemies, I don't care. I don't care. <sighs> so, I guess I just got the no gold run on, like, my first or second try. I think that was my second try. So, basically, I'm apparently amazing at Spelunky when I want to go for something. <sighs> so, now I'm back to having no goal. <laughs> Besides the ever-so-random score or speed run. What? How does that happen? How did I do that? My heart's like really beating right now. Final score, zero. <laughs> I love it, 50,000, all right. 13 minutes and 58 seconds for that. that. That actually isn't terrible. That was really impressive. I hope I'll be remembered as a hero, cause like, wow. So that leaves me with only one achievement left. I've gotten everything except for the co-op one, which is, Wow, basically. Wow. All I have to say is wow about what I just did. That was... <sighs> it's crazy. So I guess we'll just do normal stuff again. What are the odds? I mean, apparently. That wasn't super hard or something, but... How do... <sighs> I'm just so in awe, and I think it's very easy for you to tell. <sighs> oh, my God. Hey, gold, suck it. I picked you up. I have no idea how I just did that. I've said that before already, like in the last 10 seconds. Cool! I mean, that was sweet. And it was really well played, honestly. I mean, I of course made mistakes, but that doesn't mean it wasn't well played. So I feel good. I'm happy. Alright, Miss Snap, you're coming with me. Oh, you don't say there's a snack pit. I I don't care. I've I've earned it. <laughs> I've earned not caring. After doing that second try. Pretty sure that was second try. I feel quite accomplished with myself. Alright, excellent. I was a little worried about that damaging me. You know, I probably... Oh, I was totally fine. Dang it, I'm dumb. <laughs> Why'd I do it? Why'd I do it? <laughs> I'm, I don't know, I'm on, a, I'm on a high right now. I just... I don't even... Well, I never really mind messing up or dying in Spelunky, because that's kind of what you do in this game. But it, I mind even less than none, since I never mind at all. But I mind even less. And it's... It's awesome. I could have just made this like a 17 minute episode, but, you know, I feel like... Did I just back with that, or did it, did it just miss me like it totally could have? Suck it, shopkeeper. I'm just taking the machete. I don't even... Oops. Should I should ghost all the vaults with the machete, do everything with the machete, take it to my wedding or whatever. 
With Miss Nap, of course. Another machete? No, that's some bombs. It's not another machete. So disappointed in you, Spelunky. And I'm also disappointed in how that just went down. Um... Oh, come on. I can't get the upward thing like I can with the other Kajigger. Hey, get mad at me. Yeah, I suck at Shopkeeper. I'm at two health, so that's pretty not good. Oh, that's already set off. We good, son. You can whip, or, well, you know, machete, the uh, arrow traps the same way you can whip them. Useful thing to know. I think you m probably can Chris knife them as well, but I don't, I haven't done it. I don't know that one for certain. I'm just expecting that you can. I've never tried, never noticed anyone try. So, here we are. Here we are. You can also do that, which is a nice thing to be able to do. Really? That didn't... Come on. You know what? I think I can... Yeah, I can jump this. I would rescue Miss Nap, but she's just inconvenient. I'd also sacrifice her, but she's just inconvenient, as I said. Oops. Oh, God. Okay, <laughs> works for me. He got stuck in a web over there, I suppose. We're in the jungle, we have our machete. Maybe we'll see the, the black market, maybe not. I'll pay for my crime, so I guess he got hit by a tiki trap or something. And I expect that that means he's probably dead. And I probably don't have to worry about him very much. Oh yeah, I have spike shoes, that's nice. The game is so kind to me when I don't want it to be. I wouldn't have minded if that were like a jetpack. Even a plasma cannon, I might have said, okay, okay, I'll take that. Uh, of course, a jetpack doesn't even encroach on my abilities with the machete, but um, plasma cannon would have been acceptable, simply because I've never seen a plasma cannon in a crate in my personal play, only in others' play. So I, I would definitely be down for that. Suck it. So I'm, I'm looking, I'm keeping my normal keen eye out for the black market. Not that I necessarily expect to see it. <laughs> Not that I necessarily expect to see it. Or anything. Uh, well. The machete I don't think is going to carry me personally. I know it can be done, but I don't think it's going to handle me. Do this trick, since that should handle it perfectly fine. Can you guys come out here already? I'm, I'm tired of waiting. Yeah, okay. Other one? I know you're there. I know you're out there. Uh, hate this. I'm gonna walk in here, and immediately he's gonna murder me. Oh, no, he got murdered. Well, that's cool. Uh, I am going to use another bomb. I'm going to assume that there are going to be more. Where the, is that? Oh no, that's just one higher hands. Shop. So this shop is garbage, as far as my desires are concerned. Alright, uh, I'm going to... How did you get dead? Oh no, come back. gonna... Oh, no. There you go. That's what we need. Dang it. At least I got the onk, but I was about to hit him, too. Uh, I... Okay. We're gonna be fine. <laughs> I, I hadn't had that happen. I hadn't had that happen before. Yeah. Yeah. Screw you, buddy. I want my machete back. Let's see what that last shop is that we haven't seen yet. My god. I mean, I don't have spring shoes yet, so there is that. But of course, this has to be accomplished with the machete. Otherwise, it just doesn't count. 
Do you want to not do that, shopkeeper man? I know as soon as I go in there, I'm going to get shot. Okay. Nope. Nope. That's a teleporter. <laughs> that would have been fun. Well, that was a little bit of a silly situation that I put myself in and kept myself in unnecessarily, but that, that was the point. That was the fun. Sometimes you just gotta get a machete and roll with it for a while. That one was for Noir Cat, who I don't even know... I don't know if he watches my videos. But... Uh, he's just a frequenter in various Spelunky streams and other streams. And he loves his machete. He did a video where he cleared the black market with the machete. So I was just a... I was just a wannabe that time. Alright, freeze ray percent. For those of you that don't know, saying percent is just because uh, basically speedrunners put a percent in front of anything when they want to say like what's happening basically. Nah, don't care. Uh, so like the idea of freeze ray percent is you use the freeze ray and pretty much only the freeze ray. Whereas like hired help percent, take a hired help, keep them alive. But normally they're not as... Um, silly as something like freeze ray percent. They're more like any percent, which is just beat the game as fast as you can doing whatever it takes. So that, you know, there's glitches and etc. Can you not? Because I, I can't. I want to, but I can't. Okay, even if this doesn't kill you, that's okay. Jump. Hurry up and jump. Oh, okay. Just gonna kill you there real quick. Oh, this isn't even the right way to go. Well, I've made a mistake, everyone. It's never happened before in the world. I jumped on both of them at the same time. Wait, is this a completely blocked off path? That sucks. Oh, I could have gotten out of there in one. Oh, I still did. That's good. No! <laughs> The limitations of the freeze ray are definitely pretty much all of its range. Um, all of them are its range. It's okay. Alright. I'm just waiting for anything to happen, basically. It doesn't take much for something to happen. But I've already accomplished... I've accomplished a lot for this episode. Oh no, I want those things. Must commit murder. As quickly as possible. I, you thought you were going to get me. Right, I'm not speedrunning, so I am going to take the climbing gloves. I actually like them. But uh, were I speedrunning, I would have left them there. I think I skipped a crate down there that I might have been able to access at the cost of no bombs. I wasn't. I'm not sure. But at the same time, I did just get, like, a bunch of bombs. Okay. You're murdered. Now we have a cape, which is pretty good. That allows us to hover. Well, not hover. I always do that. I always make that mistake. Okay, okay. So far, so good. It allows us to glide. There you go. We glide, and we can land on spikes safely if we're doing that, among other stuff. Okay. I'm going to murder this man, just because I don't want him causing problems later. You can see his money there. Okay, I don't like this, uh... Okay, it's stuck. Alright, so that's more bombs. I don't have paste! Well, that's just silly. Still managed to kill him in one bomb. Going on without paste is actually one of the worst things. It's just not... It's pretty scary and unsafe in a lot of ways, and bad. As usual, keeping that eye out for the Market of Black. Where they sell all of the illicit stolen goods. Of course that made you mad. Okay, so this is a bit level with Old Bitey. I would say that the Black Market is, as such, pretty unlikely to be here. Which also means that I'm abandoning it, because I'm... Just, just being silly. 
I don't deal with old buddy, especially without paste. Without paste, you crazy. You a crazy, crazy dude if you want to do that. I'm not saying it's impossible. Hey, why don't you fall through? Okay, you're not going to. It's fine. I will just shoot you. Matic. Wow. Guess I would go to the haunted castle if I don't see the black market. That's always a thing that I like doing. Get the shield. Have some fun with the shield. But I do want to give a, a little look-see. Okay, you know what? I think I can make this just fine. Okay, uh, now I can kill you. That was a little scary, let's be honest with ourselves. But it also seems that there's no Haunted Castle level this time. Okay, can you seriously leave me alone? Okay, he, he died. God, I don't like that thing. So there was no Haunted Castle that I saw, which is sad, but life sometimes. I don't mind. We got another, uh, there can't be a haunted castle this time, though, I don't think. Wait, maybe there can. It can spit you out in the ice caves. Wait, but it would count as an ice caves level. Yeah, there we go. So it, there isn't a haunted castle here, since this is 2-4, right? No, it's 2-3. There can be a haunted castle. I thought I was a level further than I was. I don't know why, either. So the black market's still possible here. Oh, wow, I missed so bad. Oh, you know, just make me use a bomb. And forget that I don't have paste, because why wouldn't I have paste at this point in the game, right? Does he have paste? No, he just has stuff that I already have. All of those things I already have, besides ropes. Uh, how about no thanks anyway? I do want ropes, but I do have climbing gloves. Oops. Okay, it's fine. I'll murder this dude. He's murdered. Uh, good thing I have pace to get this crate in a safe and productive fashion. <laughs> oh well. Oh well. So this level, there won't be a castle, there won't be a black market. Because if there were, they'd have to be counting as an ice caves level, and we can't have that because they're jungle things. Okay, uh, good thing there weren't spikes down there and I wasn't counting on landing on one of those blue frogs, best frogs. Because if uh, that were the case, I would be pretty pretty dead right now. And that would kind of suck, right? Okay, I'm leaving. I don't have much health. I don't have much of anything. But what I do have is determination. No, I, I really... Uh, I'm pretty boned. But I'm always pretty boned. Everyone's always pretty boned in Spelunky. Words of wisdom. Words of wisdom? Oh no. Now I've just started something that can never go away ever. Everyone's always going to ask for the words of wisdom. <laughs> I've made a huge mistake. But maybe it's good. Maybe it's an awesome saying. Heck if I know. Okay, guess I'm going up there. Well, that was terrifying. Good thing bodies can't hit you. Oh, I actually really needed ropes, and I didn't really need bombs. Of course, I always want bombs, but I didn't really need them in the same way that I desperately needed ropes. Still gonna use a no oh, god. I made a mistake, but it turned out okay. That's all you can really ask for, usually. <sighs> Fortunately, the skeletons that spawn next to you don't seem to have the ability to ever possibly be alive. Or, you know, like the Walking Dead kind of business. Oh no! Oh god. I miscalculated a little bit. Oh uh, yeah, they don't have the ability to start walking and hurt you and stuff, as far as I've ever noticed. Which is, I mean, obviously. If they did, that would be a little bit unfair and stuff. But then again, you could always, it wouldn't be hard to just get into the habit of always whipping when you spawn or whatever happens. So there is that. It's 
it's just nice that we don't have to, basically. Although I will say it's not actually a bad policy to uh, always whip. Oh god, this is a nightmare. Okay, I knew you'd be mad. You can actually whip those, and I was trying, but I it hit my head instead of my center box, and then I died. Also, I thought I had two health. Did I get hit by... Okay. Did I get hit by something that I didn't remember getting hit by, or did they actually do two damage? Or did I get hit by both, and since it was close enough, they both did the damage? I, I don't know. I don't know. It's cool, though. I'm not, I'm not bent up about it. That was a pretty weird run. Wow, he has nine ropes and three bombs. I'm not very into that idea. Huh? Gotta go fast, like Sanic. Can't take the chest with you. You can't take a lot of things with you. Like your bombs when you mess up the whip trick, and then you're dead. You're dead, son. Well, this is... Okay, I almost just... I almost did a much stupider stupid, at least, so there is that. But I do have one health now. And that's, uh, probably gonna mean that I'm pretty dead. Not just, like, a little bit dead. Like, real, real dead. Okay. I'm not gonna ask questions that don't need to be asked. It should I should have been to the side of it and gotten hit, but instead I managed to jump on its face. It's kind of like, I what seemed to happen is that if you're moving down, you get at least a little bit of leeway with um, whether or not you're jumping on an enemy or the enemy is hitting you. Oh, you jumped at the perfect time to just jump over all of my bullets. That sucks. That was a pretty good level. Eight seconds? I like seven. Suck it, arrow trap. So there's a snack pit. Obviously, I'm going for a no gold speed run now. Oh, I'm, I picked up some gold. And then I did that because it's just... The run's over, man. Yeah, that, there's definitely some leeway. I also picked up climbing gloves, so I was pretty much lying from the start. Ha! I did do that on purpose because I wanted to be a show off. Okay, that was a good dodge. Oh, that killed both of the things. Alright. I mean, whatever you say, yo. No, I didn't ask for that. Oh, I was hoping that I would get to jump on his head, sacrifice him alive, and then jump on the other ones from the same jump. The other one's head from the same, like, the jump that got me off of his head. And then, uh, pick him up, make him expand, and then sacrifice him alive, too. It would have been pretty MLG, and I don't think that anyone's ever seen the likes of that kind of thing, uh, ever. Because generally no one is quite nearly that cool. But uh, I would have just made it happen, except that I didn't. So I, I guess that there's a reason that that greatness has never quite been shown, because it just doesn't exist. I hope you all know that I'm being completely facetious and joking about that. Some people really do think that I'm like a super arrogant dude and a jerk. I'm... I'm gonna say it's not my goal to be those things, saying that I'm not. I mean, it's... It's not an attitude of mine, it's a perceived attitude of other people's, but, like, that other people have of me. But that means that I could do work on it, and I'm just really bad at jumping. So there's that. Ah, haha, I have escaped you. I wonder if escaping is a thing, or if it's just escaping. I almost did the same thing, except that time it would have killed me. I, the same thing I did another run not too long ago. Get out of here. You know, I knew that was going to happen, and then I did that, which I didn't mean to have happen. I didn't mean to do that. Let's just have one real good run right now, and then we can, we can stop for the day. 
The makings of a good run this does not have. Huh? Had to use a rope for that, cause I'm a, I'm a silly. Give me a good, good shop. The best shop, preferably. Oh, it's a gun shop, so I guess I'm not too interested in that. Onwards to life. Amazing, please. Another shop on this floor, but a good one. With feeling, this time. Yeah, this time with feeling. He heard me. And then I messed up the whip trick again by being too quick on the draw. That's okay. Oh god, I didn't actually... Yeah, I couldn't move sideways. So that time I messed up on the daily. Totally wasn't... Well, I mean, it was my fault for not jumping on the uh, skeleton, but it wasn't my fault for dying on the spikes because of it. So that's good to know. Because I was definitely holding to the side as soon as I got um, hit there, and I was like, oh no, it, I heard the spikes, I need to get away from that. Definitely not a, not a thing. Oh, I almost didn't escape that. Oh no, I didn't escape that, and I don't know what's the shop. Yeah, I'll, I'll murder this dude, that's for sure. Sometimes you just gotta throw a dude after you stomp on his head. Excuse me, I asked for this. Oh no! Oh, okay. Based cape. Based cape. What would I do without you? Alright, let's, uh... Uh, no! Oh well, I, I was gonna not make a mistake there, but then I made a mistake. Okay, um... This, this is the run. The ideally last run. It's just gonna go swimmingly, and I have nothing to worry about. So, here's the way we're going to play this. I want the shotgun to fall down. Oh, of course it didn't. You didn't sacrifice a lot. Music's still playing whether or not there's a shopkeeper alive, simply because um, he's just not supposed to die like that. Um, while alive. <laughs> he's not supposed to die while alive. That's a pretty logical statement, I guess. So I have six favor now. Out. Dang it. There goes my extra health as always. Ah, I didn't mean to jump. I'm or yeah, I didn't mean to jump, I just meant to fall. Screw it, I'm only using one bomb and I'm just doing it because I'm lazy too. So now we jump on his head and we leave. Definitely the run. I just want to see the jungle again. See that sweet, sweet green. You know, I'm not gonna take the chance. I'm just gonna kill this thing. Burn this thing too. And I'm gonna take you, chest, and I'm just gonna chuck you down there, and you're gonna be exactly what you are. Um, okay, so. Okay, excuse you. Excuse me. I knew you were gonna do that. Oh, that's, uh. The world is ending. I just needed to deal with that thing, and uh, sadly, that was not the way I wanted to have to deal with it. Why are you mad? Why did I jump? Ah, <sighs> jungle, I just want to see your pretty face. I just want to see your pretty face, Dia. <clears throat> now, please allow me to do so. This, this urn, right now. Low percent. Oh no. 
I mean, at least I dodged the spikes completely accidentally. That was also completely accidental. But awesome. That's a really inconvenient shop to get to. Uh, I guess I got three ropes for that. I mean, that, that's cool too. Oh, calm down. Can you? Thanks. Can you? Thanks. Oh, Miss Snap, why aren't you just chilling there? This is the one. Right now. The one and only. Alright. Sure. I'm not gonna question it. It was intentional, obviously. Oh, no. At least he didn't hit me a second time. That would have sucked. Alright, just take your time, Bat. I got all day. Is Miss Nap over here? I might have shot her. Oh my god, she lived. She lives. She's gonna kill herself on spikes immediately down there to watch. Like, I have absolute faith that she's not boned right now. I knew that was happening. That was intentional. You're dead, because I think I have spike shoes. That is definitely something that I have acquired in my travels today. Alright, let's do it. That's not the last level of the mines. I really wanted it to be the last level of the mines. I'm going to die on this level somehow. Somehow, I will find a way to not make it to the jungle. Yes. Purely intentional. Okay, I'm gonna not bother this dude and his his fine damsel. Okay, I'm gonna shoot. I'm just gonna leave, in fact, since he apparently didn't feel like getting shot, but now we see the jungle. I don't even, I don't want to talk about it at this point. This just keeps happening to me. See if I care about the freaking jerk bag. I do have the u Jedi. Come on, please. There we go. So I'm going to be informed that, hey, you're near the black market, bro. I'm be like, sweet, man. I have spike shoes. Blue Frog, excuse me. Hey, I, I need to pick this shotgun back up. Uh, how about I need to just bomb my way through here? Perfect. Hopefully I didn't miss the black market. Ah, <sighs> oh, the start of this music, it always has a little beep thing. And it sounds like the U Jedi blinking. But it's not. Hey, you know what? The cost of all too many of my bombs and the potential loss of the black market? Let's do it. Who doesn't love a good shield run? I know the answer is nobody. Everyone loves a good shield run. Everyone loves a bad shield run. Dun, dun. Yeah, yeah, I know. You want a piece. Everyone wants a piece. Spike Shoes let me jump through his mask and armor and stuff. Oh no, Blue Frog! Uh, something exploded over here. Oh no. Okay, so we have, at the moment, a predicament. A predicament that I'm about to solve. Okay, he's been shot once. Now he's dead. Predicament solved. 
Dang it, I tried to hold forward so exactly that wouldn't happen. And it just... I guess forward isn't forward enough. I should have known it wouldn't work out, but it didn't work out, and that's where I'm going to end the episode. I hope you enjoyed this episode of Spelunky, of Spelunky as much as I did, because I really like this one. Thank you for watching, and I will see you next time.